Hey guys, okay, so let the real fun begin. I'm Hi. going to do my What Stinks Weekly Wax Melts. Hi. Gavin's here Hi. assisting Hi. me because he gets pissed off when I do videos without him now. Oops. I knew that was going to happen. Oh, that wasn't your fault, honey. That was my leg. Okay, so I messed up the zoom, I'm sure of it. Let me just take a look and see. So the first one I have is Juliet is the Sun and will always have Paris from Vintage Chic Scents. This is from Liz. She sent this to me. Um, I bought her a D stash and she sent me a ton of stuff. Or I bought a D stash from her and she sent me a ton of stuff. This is amazing. Juliet is the Sun is just a great blend. Very citrusy, bright. Um, will always have Paris. It's just this, like. To me, it's like a strawberry melon type blend. It's really pretty, fruity. Together, this was phenomenal. I got a great throw from this. So I was excited to have that. And I didn't have any vintage chic scents at the time. I did that in my 24 watt hot plate warmer in my living room and it filled up the room beautifully. Caramel Buttercream Pie from Rainbow Melts. This is one that is newer well, let me see what's going on with this focus here. There we go. Okay, so this one was newish, well, only a year old. This one did not throw too well. Um, I got the caramel a little bit, but it was pretty light. So that was kind of a bust. This was <laughs> this was a sample I got from Super Tarts in Invisible Woman, and it was really good. This one threw um, really good. Winter Wonderland from Rainbow Melts. And this is actually from 2014. Mm. Vanilla Bean Noel, Buttercream, and Toasted Marshmallow. It was really just pretty. I really got the Vanilla Bean Noel and the Buttercream. Um, I did this in my 24 watt hot plate in my living room as well. It did beautifully. There were a bunch of little, like, I don't know, like thumb tarts. I don't know what to call them. But it was fantastic and it threw really good for being old. Okay, blackberry butter jam cookies from Candles from the Keeping Room. That smelled great. So your typical, <clears throat> pardon me, your typical blackberry jam butter scent. Um, and it threw amazingly, like always. I melted this in a tea light warmer. I think there were four tarts, and I did all four in the tea light at separate times. I just got over being sick, so you're going to have to pardon me. This I just melted the other day. Strawberry white cake from Sugar and Spice. This was Fantastic. It was actually really good. This is a really good strawberry white cake scent. I think it's one oil. I will order this again. The throw was really good. Again, 25 hot warm or 24 watt. Why am I saying 25? Michael's warmer in my living room. Fantastic. That's where I melt most of my stuff because that's where I am most of the time. Oh, front porch lemon marshmallow. So this is the last bag of front porch I had. This is for my latest order, which is probably a year or so. I don't know. It's when she made these bags, when she started doing the, the zip bags, which I love. I think that's amazing. It, I had no scent with this. Um, it's older, and I mean, I, I'm guessing that's why. I'm going to be placing another order with Front Porch. Um, I realize there are a lot of her scents that I really did like. I'm just going to get singles and melt them faster than what I normally did, and I had four grubbies, so I did that a couple times in my kitchen, a couple times in my living room. Prancer from Super Tarts, um, an all-time favorite scent. I love this. If you guys have Prancer and you don't want it, send it to me. <laughs> send it to me. I will buy it from you. I love this scent, and I'll melt it year-round. It is definitely a Christmas scent. In fact, I melted this on Christmas. But it's something that I like all year round. It's like mistletoe and berries. And I get a green. Oh my god, I can't open it. I was going to open a box when I was trying to. Okay, well, I can't open it. What's going on here? Struggling. I can do it. I Okay, never mind. Probably it open. Uh, it's just so. It's like kind of like pine, but not really. And then with the berries. And I love it. It smells like Christmas. It smells like, yeah, it smells like fresh with a little, bun, little bit of lavender, though, which... Lavender, huh? Yeah, Gavin thinks everything has lavender in it. So yeah. this... 
You don't think everything has lavender in it? Like the lavender, I mean the blueberry, lemon, and cotton. Okay, this is Coral Rock Candy from um, Lessing Sun Candles. Super old, as you can tell, and the oils are just drenched the heck out of it. I mean, look at that thing. It's soaked in oils. It threw good. Um, it was mostly the rock candy that I picked up on. I don't, Ooh, I, I didn't smell the coral, whichever that may be. Let's see what else. And I did that in my dining room in the centerpiece warmer that I got from my friend Rhonda. From Super Tarts, this was a part of the advent calendar that Brandy had sent me. Apple butter and pecan pumpkin waffles. This was awesome. I did this in my dining room in the centerpiece warmer, which is a pumpkin, and it's still there because it throws so good. I really need to go purchase one. Um, this was amazing. You got the apple butter and the pumpkin pecan waffles. Oh, I really enjoyed that one. It threw really well. It was just a tiny tart, too. Um... But it was fantastic. It it threw so good. And you could smell both notes. Annabelle doll. This is strawberry pomegranate. And something else. From Vintage Cheek Scents. I did this in my kitchen in my Glade Warmer. It smelled really pretty. It's like a... You get the pomegranate and the strawberry, but then you get like something else. Or has is there a marshmallow in here? It smells. It kind of smells like some candy that you know. Yeah, it kind of has a candyish smell to it. That would be... That you hate. Um, but it I liked it. I enjoyed it. It was really nice. So that threw really good. Christmas. Pancakes and coffee, also Pancakes. from the advent calendar. Yeah. She didn't send me like a full calendar. I think she did twelve unless it was twelve days of Christmas. I'm not sure. This is amazing, and I wish and hope and pray that Brandy still watches YouTube videos. And does this in a clamshell in one of her openings because this scent was phenomenal. If you like coffee scents and pancakes, coffee. you will love this scent. It was amazing. I did this in my living room in my Michael's warmer and it just was so phenomenal. Ooh, coffee. I coffee. This is Corner Coffee Shop from Better Homes and Gardens. On cold, this smelled really good. It's um, latte and biscotti. On warm, though, I got nothing. I did... Two, then I did four, then and then four, two. and it just, I got no throw. I mean, nothing. Da, da, Harry's Christmas. This is actually really good. Um, I did not think I would like this. Harry's Christmas. I don't know what is in here, but <laughs> it just smells really good. Um, I know Harry's like an orange type of scent. Or no, Harry's, it's a bread type of scent. That can't be right. Mm, Maybe like blue dry. sugar or something is in here. It smells, like the, it smells like the taste of dry bread. It smells like the taste of rye bread? Dry. Dry bread. But I, I did enjoy this one and I was really? quite shocked actually. Throw was really awesome. A couple more. And I'm only doing empty, so of course I melted more stuff. But Snape, what do you get? Yep, Snape from Super Tarts. This is phenomenal. This is before the scents were listed, but it's a very creamy, caramel-type cookie scent. Butterscotch. Ooh, ooh. Mm. And it smells so amazing and just like a buttery butterscotch ooh. or caramel. Ooh. And then you get that bakery. And it smells like caramel. And I have this going. You get bakery from it. Caramel with like something really bad in Like, I don't know. This is the one that you said smelled really good. It was melting. But this was a fantastic one. I have two more clamshells, and I have a sampler with a scent shot coming in the way, so I'm excited because it's definitely a great bakery scent, something I would not have gone for in the past, but love it, love it, love it. I have one more. I don't know what that is. No, I'll put it for Lemon from Tiffany. I ordered some more lemon, so I finally melted the three... Teddy tarts that I had in lemon, and this is I such this is such a good lemon scent. I put this um, usually with her three tarts. What I do is I put it. Yeah, yeah oh, it's just like, amazing. I almost felt like it was. Smells like the soda candy, like the little fake soda cans candy. Mm -hmm. So I put um, one in my living room, one in my dining room, one in my kitchen, and it was lemon lemon heaven. I was cleaning at the time. It was the perfect scent. 
threw really well. Loved it. It threw well in all the warmers. So, um, yeah, that's actually all I have for scent picks this week, guys. Or scent melts because I'm only doing empties. I might change that because there's a lot of bakery bags and stuff now. And I don't know how long it will take me to get through those. But I will be back with my picks for the week probably tomorrow. All right, guys. Have a great day. I'll see you later. Bye. Bye-bye.